in Mandela Jesus amazing how time flies now three of those eight weeks we spent traveling back to South Africa by plane to go to my daughter's wedding and Frick's daughter's wedding and the balance of time was spent sorting out warranty issues and provisioning Sisu with food and fuel we're on our way to the Canaries and predict when Frickens is going to take nine to ten days uh, to do 1,288 miles, but let's see what Sisu does. Por ahí todos y todas esas poses que tú conoces gracias a mi mujer ni tu amigo pero it is amazing how persons fears perspectives and ideas change as you go along I can remember when we first started sailing and all these encounters with all these ships geez that used to scare the hell out of me I used to check on that radar even if the ship was like 50 miles away I couldn't keep my eyes off that little green little boat on the radar I was like fix, fixated to the screen and now it's like you know it's like coming right past us so no more fears it's so amazing <laughs> Somos Adán y Eva Y estoy listo para tomar el castigo yeah. Y todo lo prohibido Y los pescados que tú y hemos cometido Son por ahí todos y todas esas poses que tú conoces Gracias a mi mujer ni tu amigo Pero en vivo solo con Yep, that was pretty scary. It was about a drop of 1.2 meters from the jetty down to Sisu. 
Thank goodness um, Frick's tall has got long arms because he had to climb up these huge tires to get to the top. Yep, not a good time. Okay, we are eh, on the island Diero, which is the most westerly island of the Canaries, in a little harbour called Porto de la Restinga, with a population of 6,000 people. So on the nice, whole island. Nice and small and quaint. Now, one of our first projects that we normally do is we go restaurant hunting. So, let's see what they deliver today. Actually, more bar hunting. Let me make it sound proper this time. We, don't, we eat as well and as And that's, that's the town. That's the whole of the town. <laughs> and it's Saturday and the, and and it's the marina. <laughs> the whole of the marina. I think there's maybe more boats in the marina than there's people in the town. <laughs> and Sisu is the biggest boat. <laughs> yeah, Sisu is there. The back. Yeah, so we couldn't find a spot in there. There's just not big enough spot for us. But what a clear, clear, clear marina. The water is, you can see right to the bottom. It is so clean. It's and very clean. In the harbor. That's, that's very impressive. In search of the restaurants. Bar de Des de las Calmas. First restaurant. The wind decided to come up. Um, the food was amazing. I had calamari and frick had like what we would call a chicken slitchel, which is brilliant. The language barrier was a bit of a problem with our waiter, waitress in the beginning, um, but then she sent a patron along, a, what do you call it, a patriarch or whatever, the, the lady of the establishment, who spoke brilliant English and she explained to us, because we've got this thing about ordering fish that's got the eyes on their heads and everything. So yeah, we don't like that. We need to speak English when we order food. So. But what we ordered was amazing. So a good start to restaurant hunting. Cheers. Yeah, cheers. The wine is, oh, oh, oh. And then the captain ordered beer, and I could see his face. He's getting very mellow here. And then we did the Super summer. mellow. Then we discovered the first two beers he had is like 8% alcohol, which is hectic. It's double what we used to. But sorry, and then he went sorry, sorry. To my defense, it was 8.5%. And, <laughs> and then he said he's going to tone it down. So he ordered a tequila beer. So I don't know where tonight's going to end. So it's, it's let's only, do the first restaurant. It's only 5.9. It's not, <laughs> but it's tequila. It's, it's less. <laughs> it's tequila. <laughs> so one down. I think there's about 11. So 10 to go. Ouch. <laughs> this place is very quiet. Very, very quiet. It's still very quiet. But the beer is good. <laughs> yeah, the local beer. Cruz Campo Radler. Radler means. Cruz Campo Radler. Radler. Radler means with lime or lemon. Um, with whatever local beer there is, so I assume this is the local beer with lemon. <laughs> Very purple. We've been here before, but this is the only place this time of the morning that's open for a beer. <laughs> it's not really morning morning, it's around 12 o'clock already, but all the other places are still closed. So we popped in here and it's quite lively as you can see. Um, but we also now discovered nice chicken, roasted chicken here. So you might just as well stay around and taste the chicken. Hopefully it's nice Spanish chicken. Not sure whether they get Spanish chicken or Portuguese chicken. But maybe we'll stay. This was our first place as we arrived yesterday. 
and we're back here again and it's five a.m. and it was awesome and I think we're gonna come back here again tonight so for sure. Brilliant ambiance. Okay, so I think so far one of our favorite places is this place. Um, first because the, the menu is in English as well, so you can understand without the Google Translate. Because some of the Google Translate refers you to old lady, and I don't want to eat an old lady. So, and apparently the gourmet here is fried um, cheese, local cheese. So we're gonna try that. No good cheese with some sweet jam and raisins and homemade bread. Can't get any better than this. We are cheating a bit. We came here last night. It was recommended by the port captain. He actually found and made a booking for us, which we missed, which is Casa Juan. The service and the food was absolutely on the top of our list. Shopping was a total breeze. I could find everything and anything I needed um, from fresh veggies, fruit, meat. Okay, we couldn't really find sheep, but we used to, but we found goat meat, which was perfect. The thing I battled with was sugar. Um, not that we're into sugar, we do need sugar to make a rum. Uh, we normally just use brown sugar if we need sugar. Okay, another bar, restaurante. Doesn't look very inviting, but the wine is good, the beer is good, so we're happy with that. And I think this is our second last place that we may explore on this 6,000 inhabitant island. <laughs> and, but the ambiance in this place is super amazing. It's just the whole feel of the place. It really feels like relaxed, laid back. You can see everybody knows everybody. They walk up the streets, everybody greets everybody. It's a super awesome place. So the place after this we're going to try, which is going to be the last place. And we'll give you feedback, which is our number one place. What a superb ending to a superb couple of days in the island. Italian restaurant, the highlight. I think we started off with a band and we're ending with a band. I had risotto and Frick had lasagna and it was just amazing. The food, the ambiance, the service, the wine, perfect though. So, So we've finished where we started um, at Tasca La Laia. Um, there's a toss up between two restaurants that we 
we both we, we like them both. Um, the 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 fugio, the fugio is the white one, and then this one. The meat is brilliant here. So Frick came back for his meat, and I'm trying fish today, and it's superb. And the service is lovely. You can sit outside. They serve you all the way from there. And yes, I think it's a toss-up between the two. So we both we enjoyed both. Orange ball is probably as wearing ball, and that is the mark of the end of the sanctuary. So anything further than that, we are legal. So we'll try and stick to the legal rules and look for a suitable end to reach. But I think we might just lose that one. And this is going to be also officially our first anchor. Uh, it's not a watch. We need to check out if it gripped. It looks like a lot of rocks and sand. Yeah. But this side of the island is all green, and the other side was all volcanic. And I decided to um, cook us something to eat. We haven't eaten yet today, so irrespective of the sea state, the chef must carry on. <laughs> So I'm going to try and do some one pot dish here, just to get us something in the stomachs.
just like such a sweet little place. Uh, there's ladders going up against the rocks. So we might think of anchoring a little bit more up. It's quite choppy here yeah? and then coming back to the dinghy. of years. <laughs> we did a whole shoot <laughs> and then the camera wasn't on so we're gonna retake. <laughs> yeah, take two. Take two. There's, there's not even a take one but this is take two for us. <laughs> so we arrived. Yeah, we arrived. Um, we first went to the hotel over there. That's the hotel. That's the main reason why we stopped here. And we had a backup plan. This nice restaurant de Casa de Comitas. And it's, it's closed. On Mondays it's closed. I okay, guess so what day is today? <laughs> it's Monday. Monday. It's closed on Monday. And the hotel is being renovated. <laughs> We've got no luck. Yeah, and this is after a very dangerous dinghy ride. <laughs> very dangerous step ladder embarkment or what do you call the thing? It's like a massive cliff down here that you have to go. Dinghy's right at the bottom. Yeah, very, very, very pretty hectic. <laughs> You guys will see, it's very, very active. It's a cute little town. Look at these big, huge volcano mountains at the back. It is huge. It's just like incredibly, incredibly big. This is, yeah, this is our, <coughs> our last stop on on this island, um, El, El, El Hero Island. El this is going to be yeah. our last stop, so our last anchorage, and then we're going to go over to the next island. Uh, we wanted to continue, but then we saw that we will arrive at the next place at 3 o'clock in the morning, morning so. <laughs> which is not a good idea if you next to volcanic islands and lots of like uh, pinnacle rocks is sticking out. This is not not easy. Not a good idea. So not a good idea. We'll go and have a barbie, barbecue on Sisuna. Yes, I think that's a good idea. Rum. Barbecue and rum. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go tackle the dinghy ride again. <laughs> yeah, the dinghy ride. Yeah. And there it's the pics all the way at the bottom. So now the next daunting task is to go get back into the pigs. <laughs> Which is freaking scary. Oh dearie me. So I guess I need to go get my ass down there. <laughs> yes, it.
quieres y él, pero estás con él, baby. En mi habitación, shon, 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 shon. Y con mi canción, shon, 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 shon. Haciendo el amor, mor, 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 mor. Es que quieres y él, pero estás con él, baby. Acércate, aclara tus dudas. Yo soy mejor que él, de aquí te mudas. Con dulce ni eres miel, tú eres un Judas Que te abrigue la vida porque es muy cruda Acércate y de paso, te hago un repaso De todo lo bueno que tuviste a mi lado Yo si sí dudo mucho que tenga lo que yo tuve Él una avioneta y yo el dueño de las nubes And that's it for Hero It's been a wonderful trip and thank you for joining us So we'll see you on the next island, La Playa.